Jesus spent three years equipping 12 guys to be fishers of men, essentially to become like him, to live the way that he did. He commanded them saying, all authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me. Go therefore and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. And listen, he says, teaching them to observe all that I've commanded you. But how can someone follow Jesus, become like him, and, and be the church if no one ever teaches them how? They can't. And, and that's why as disciples, we've been called to equip. You know, at The Grove, like we exist to make disciples. Discipleship is our mission and it's our sole strategy because it's Jesus' strategy. Now to help us kind of wrap our heads around what discipleship looks like, we break it down into three components. Exalt, equip, and engage. Now today we're gonna to focus on equip. Equip, like we're committed to equip the church for the work of the ministry. To teach men, women, and, and children all that Jesus commanded. Now there are, are two primary ways uh, that are true of us or becoming true of us, and we call these pursuits. So let's talk about the first one multiplying mature disciples. Now our goal is for every disciple to thoroughly know the gospel. So, so we know God and we know that what he's done and what he promises to do. Like we're equipping disciples like you to live into our new identity in Christ, empowered by the Holy Spirit. Now we're committed to helping you establish a lifelong foundation of learning and growing as a disciple. Now there are a few ways we do this. Disciple making groups, uh, core classes offered throughout the year, and coaching uh, for those that are discipling others. Now the place to get started, it's disciple making groups. Uh, these are designed to help you deepen your walk with the Lord and learn what it looks like to abide as, as disciples of Jesus. Our second pursuit as we equip the church is to cultivate biblical community. You know, God designed us to live in fellowship with one another. You know, the Greek word for fellowship that we see used in the Bible is koinonia. And koinonia means being as committed to each other as we are to Jesus Christ. And so we commit to learn and live out God's word together. You know, to live as true friends that love and serve and encourage and build one another up. Now the primary ways we cultivate biblical community at The Grove are through neighborhood communities and serving. Neighborhood communities connect you with people who live in your neighborhood and call The Grove their church home. And serving connects you with others in our church to use the gifts that God has given you, strengthening the body. Now at The Grove, we're committed to equipping the church. Uh, that's you for ministry. Now I encourage you to take the next step in your faith by joining a disciple making group and connecting with a neighborhood community. You know, we have a variety of opportunities uh, for you to serve and our leaders would love to help you find the right fit. Now our prayer is that together, you know, we can multiply mature disciples and cultivate biblical community for the display of his splendor.